Welcome back to Hylix. I've just gotten the person who's now joined my party back his paper cup, something that he's been searching for for a long time apparently, even though it only took me like five minutes to find it. And now apparently they love me and now they're following me, so I've got a party of two, which is very good because now I can uh, use them to help me in combat, which I really need help with. And I've also just learned the new ability, Space Shuriken, and I want to test it out, so let's test out my increased party size and my new ability right now. Fight me. Come on. Alright, only three? Shouldn't be a big deal. Um, oh, I forgot I was damaged. Uh, I should have healed before the fight. Alright, well before anything, let's try... Oh, I don't even have the willpower to use space shurikens. Alright, let's just put everybody to sleep right now. If I can. Hopefully I can prevent a statue from uh, blinding. And, oh yeah, what special abilities do you have? Panorama. May confuse enemies and inflict slight damage. Let's do that. Let's just try to confuse the enemies to begin with, and then, while they're confused, attack them. Oh, blinded. Sleep, sleep, failed. Alright, so just one's awake. Alright, confuse. Confusion. Confusion, okay. So the statue's confused. And let's just beat up on the statue. Ow. Just keep attacking it. Try to take it out. Ah, we're gonna keep missing. Oh god, Wayne's gonna die! Okay, need to heal. No, not juice box. Not juice box. Vegetable. You continue to attack. Didn't do much of anything. Alright, come on. Statue's gotta be really close to dying. Stop blinding us. Oh my god. There we go. Alright, attack the one on the left, and you try to confuse them. Alright, you need to heal again. Attack the one on the left. I'm not sure how well that confusion is working. Okay, whew. 175 bucks, cool. Juice box, frozen burrito. Meat, meat. Alright, we are very close to death, and... I didn't even get a chance to use my space shuriken ability, no! Uh, we need to rest. Yeah, let's go, like, pay for the bathtub to rest. I could use my items to restore stuff, but that would be pretty expensive. I'd rather just pay the 25 bucks to go take a bath. If only I can remember how to get there. Uh... Wait a minute, isn't there a couch over here on the left? Yeah. Can I... Oh, can I not rest on it? Uh, I guess not. Alright, to the bath it is. I think it's somewhere up here on the right. Yeah, I think it's right up here. There we go. Yep, 25 bucks, sure. Alright, did that restore my buddies? Yeah, so it restores everybody. Okay, cool. Alright, we are 100% good to go. So let's go back there once more. See if there's anything big I've missed, and once again, actually test out my Space Shuriken ability, because it sounds amazing. Go ahead and save.
I know I've seen a unique enemy type, too. I want to try to fight that. The one that's super fast. Yeah, you. Come here. Are you like a boss or something? It's just one enemy. I feel like it's a boss. Alright, Wayne. Uh... What does that say? Flesh... Flesh dash? Flesh dash. <laughs> it's a fleshy mustache. Ew. Oops, I... I don't know what I just did. Oh, I see. I couldn't see what I was actually pressing because the background is blue and the highlight for the buttons is also blue. Whoops. Anyway, okay. I think it's time for space shurikens. Strikes quickly, deals double damage. Do it. Then you just, um... I guess confuse? Sure. 44 damage, nice. Alright, let's just do normal attacks for now. This thing's taking a pounding. I haven't taken any damage at all, is it gonna do anything? Yeah, is it gonna do anything at all? Hello? Oh my god. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Alright, Space Shuriken. Again. And you? Um... Why don't you use a vegetable on Wayne? Thirty-five damage! Ugh! Wayne is not the one that needs the healing now. Alright, use a vegetable on... Dedis now. And you, um... Hmm... Just attack, I guess? Yeah, I guess just attack. How much health does this thing have? Let's use a juice box. And you just attack. I love the animation for that juice box, that's awesome. Oh my god, Dedis is almost dead. Um, why don't you, I could try putting it to sleep. Let's try it. And then you heal again. I'm going through all my vegetables. This is not good. Oh god, don't go for Dedis. Dedis is dead if you go for Dedis. Okay, whew. Alright, please go to sleep. Okay, it's asleep, thank god. That gives us a couple turns to do stuff. Nice. Let's just keep pounding it. Um, space shurikens again. Normal attack for you. Okay. Woo! 500 bucks. Yeah, that was definitely a boss or something, or a mini-boss or something of the sort. Meat, meat, meat. Yay, meat! Okay, anything else here? Any other unique enemies or something? Uh, there's no reason to look at you again, I think. Right? Just gonna be the same ability I already learned. Ooh, pile of money. I'll take it. Yeah, I think that's it. Found the paper cup, found all the piles of money, I think. Fought the unique enemy. Come on, let me through. Yeah, I think that's it. Alright, I feel like I need new items, like better armor and better weapons and stuff. Excuse me. And I do have quite a bit of money. How much do I have? Yeah, I've got 1,300. So I think it's time to go on a shopping spree. Let's buy some helpful oddities. <laughs> Pew 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 p
Allows wearer to wield two weapons. That would be awesome. That would be really awesome. But I think preventing blind status for 100 is more important because blinding is incredibly debilitating. Wait, debilitating? Debilitating? I don't think I said that right. That's good too, but I think having two weapons is better than having your one weapon sometimes do poison. So let's let's get the bleak cellophane. Let's get two, so that we can both wear it. There we go. I've got it on my crown. Cellophane on my crown. There we go. Alright, now we both cannot be blinded. Excellent. Now, I don't remember where the other shops are. I just I think they're kind of like everywhere, pretty much. Armor, excellent. Alright, now we can afford the combat bell. Giant metal dome apparel, too large to be worn with any other armor. Okay, it looks like it's significantly better than what we have. It says plus 50 for Wayne and plus 60 for Dedus. Hmm. Yeah, let's get two of these. Uh, wait a minute, what? Oh, that's what it meant by can't be worn with any other... I thought it... Oh. Shit. So there goes the cellophane and everything. Um... Is it worth it? I don't think it is. I made a mistake. I misread what that meant. Um... Well, in Dennis's case, it's definitely worth it. Unless I'm fighting enemies that can blind. Because the only thing that Dedus is losing is just the bleak cellophane, which only prevents blinding. But what about Wayne? I'm losing the deflector and the crown. I mean, well, you know Optimize is supposed to give you the best stuff, right? And Optimize is telling me I should wear it, so fine. Uh, let's go with that. I'm just going to trust in the Optimize. And, you know, if we fight enemies that blind us all the time, then I can always switch back to the cellophane. Oh yeah, loops around to here. How are we doing? Should we... Yeah, let's restore ourselves. There we go. I think we should buy new weapons, too. Um... Crap, where was the weapon dealer? Are you the weapon dealer? Yeah. Mm, oh, the bat is actually worse than Dedis's Dirk. Hmm. Uh, in that case, I'm just going to stick with what I have. I kind of want to go back and buy the thing that allows you to wield two weapons, but that's probably a piece of armor or something that I won't be able to wear with the bell or something. I don't really know. I'm just going to go. Good enough for now. Okay, now I think we're ready to take on the enemies here. Let's go ahead and save. Although, again, I could always avoid them, but let's try to take them on and see how, how easy it is. Try to blind them all again. And why don't you open up by... Oh, you've got space shurikens now, too. Is it worth trying to confuse them as well as make them sleep? Probably not. It's also probably not worth using space shurikens on such lowly enemies, I would guess. So let's just normally attack them. Sleep, fail, sleep. Okay, so middle one. Let's try to go for the middle one. Um, it looks like attacking enemies also maybe wakes them up, I think, is what I just saw.
Okay, these things seem pretty easy. Yeah, these things aren't too bad. $600 for that? Oh my god. That seems disproportionately high compared to what I was just fighting. Let's keep fighting them. Once again, let's try to put them to sleep. Why don't you just attack one? Just attack star on the left. Wayne's gonna need some healing soon. But this seems to mostly... most of them to sleep. Uh, yeah, two asleep, one failed. Doom Spiral, ow. Oh, Dennis is actually stunned. Uh-oh. Uh, let's heal. I'm almost out of vegetables, though, that's not good. I wonder if the vegetables regrow in the garden. It's possible. Alright, we're taking a beating here. Mm, let's actually use the space shuriken. I want to kill it this turn. Yes, yeah, 600 more dollars. Oh my god. This is if you want to farm for money, this is where to do it. I even found some... I found two dynamites. Damn. But again, it comes down to tedium. I don't really want to keep fighting them. Um, okay, well I encounter these. I'll attack them. Failed, failed sleep. Okay, so only one's asleep. Not too good. Six hundred more dollars. More dynamite. Yeah, dynamite is not a rare thing. Uh, access warp. Ooh. God, I love the art so much. You know, I'd love to see like a uh, like a making of for this game. You know, showing some of the actual models used and their creation and how they were digitized and all that. That'd be really cool. Found a paper cup. Uh, huh? Wasn't that a box? Also, that looks like a brain cube. Mysterious glyphs and vegetable, uh, vegetal motifs adorn its smooth surface. Huh, I guess another paper cup for another source of water if I find it. Is that an enemy down there? Let me save it just in case. Hello? I can't can't do anything with it. Nope, they're just creatures. Friendly creatures. Or at least not violent creatures. Um, this vault is off limits. Please go away. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. What if I come back instead? It's like, I'm gonna have to destroy you if you don't leave. Mm. I don't wanna leave. I see a TV, which means abilities. I see a stack of money. I see a suitcase. I see a toilet, I think. I don't know. Alright, I'll leave you alone for now. But I'm probably gonna come back. Is 
This game is seriously way larger than I thought it'd be. I feel like it's gonna take me like a dozen hours just to finish. Uh, I'm sure it's not that long. I think it estimated, like I think on the website for this game, I think it said it's a couple hours long, but it feels like it's gonna be much longer. Kitty cat lizard thing. Hi. Meow. Visitors are rare. Well, maybe it's because your cat looks kind of like a human crawling on the ground and it creeps people out. It's hot. Ouch. <laughs> you know what? This hallway here. This hallway here on the top right looks like, uh, it looks like somebody squeezed out like a mustard bottle. Or like ketchup on a hot dog or something. I like it. Sleep? Oh, yeah. Yes, please. Hmm, this is a line that we heard before from one of the fishes, I think. Flesh and will restored. Excellent. So I guess it's a free place to uh, restore all your stuff. Thank you very much for your hospitality. enemies? Oh. Oh, that is an enemy. Hi. Let's try to put them to sleep. I feel like these are going to be strong enemies, so let's use space shurikens. Malign hologram and guard. Let's go for the hologram. And put them to sleep. Please, 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 please work. Failed, failed, great. Keep attaching the holog attacking the hologram. Let's hope it doesn't have too much health. It's uh, performing calibration, which I guess is buffing it. Oh, okay, it's dead. We should be fine from here. Ouch. It's a pretty strong AoE attack. Alright, let's do space shurikens. There we go. 250 bucks. Seems so paltry compared to those $600 encounters from before that were a lot easier. Alright, let's avoid them. Oh, no, I didn't want to get into combat. No, 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 no. Especially not against three. Oh shit, I was una unable to escape. I didn't even know that was possible. Uh-oh. Uh, I might be about to die. I need to escape right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're dead. Mm -hmm. Oh, dead is evaded. The first one. Okay, come on, come on. All right, one more. Okay, here we go. No, oh, come on. No fair. We're dead. Dead is... Uh... Splat. That's such a creepy image. My face melting off. Alright, well, it's kind of a cool thing. Because now we get to give dynamite to the person who wanted to blow up the wall. Yeah, let's take a nap. Alright, the thing I don't get, though, is if taking a nap on the couch restores all my will and everything, then what does the meat grinder do? Um, oh, deposited 21 meat into the grinder. Your maximum flesh rose 42 points. Oh, it doesn't restore your flesh. It increases your max, your max flesh count. That's huge. Yeah, that's, that's a massive increase. Well, let's go take a... Oh, and it did it for the whole party, too, not just me. 
Not just Wayne. Let's take another nap. Yeah, look at our health now. 152, 182. That's gonna help a lot. Alright, let's go blow up a wall. Or watch somebody blow up a wall, I guess. I don't think I'm gonna do it myself. There we go. Nice line of houses. Alright, here you go. Have fun. Whoa. I'll let you check it out first. Hmm. Friendly creatures. They look like wigs that have gained sentience. Learned Calibration. Oh, that's what the hologram was just doing. I'm guessing that's a buff. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what it is. It's probably a buff. Probably passes the turn and increases your might, I think. Temporarily increases mightiness. Yeah. get back. So I choose whatever crystal I want to go back to, right? But which color reflects the closest point to where I just was? I don't remember. Well, let's save it. I can't go back. Where do the other places go? No, I don't want to save. How do I load? I guess I'd have to quit back to the title screen or something. Hmm. Alright, I guess I'll live with it. Do I have enough money that I want to spend it on something? 3,000. That's a lot. Um, oh, you know what? Yes. Yes, you know what? It costs 1,000 to get the item that allows you to attack with two weapons. So I can buy two of those and buy bats. So we can both attack with two weapons. That would be incredibly valuable for combat. Um, I just need to remember where to buy that. I think it's off to the right. Which I think I can access by going around here. Yeah, I think it's in here? Yeah, you're the weapon person. Yep. Mm. Oh, no, but you only sell weapons. You don't sell the buff. Uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna need an extra bat, right? I, in fact, I'm actually gonna need two bats. I'm gonna need one more bat for Wayne and one bat for Dedis. Alright. So that's that taken care of. Yeah, where was the buff? Where, where, where? Somewhere on the left, I guess, because that's the only other place that stores exist. What do you sell again? Burritos? Yeah, juice boxes and burritos. I wonder how effective they actually are. Given how cheap they are, I'm guessing not very. Alright, was it you? Yes. Mil-spec Biomod allows wearer to wield two weapons. Turbo Tendons. Sounds amazing. Let's just get one to start with and just make sure it's going to work the way I think it's going to work before I spend a ton of money. So let's start with Wayne. Alright, so where does it go? I I'm guessing I'm going to have to take off the combat bell, right? So let's put back on the toilet paper, which means I can also put back on the trash can lid and the bleak cellophane, and yep, it's this. 
accoutrement. Double bats, oh yeah. I'll wear toilet paper any day if it means I get to have beat people with two bats while wearing cellophane on my face. All right, let's get another one. I have a feeling this is gonna make me like way overpowered. It just feels like it. Okay, you have. I want you to wear nothing. Okay, there we go. Oh, I didn't know I had two trash can lids. Cool. Alright, everything's good. Oh yeah, you can't have the trash can lid when you're using another weapon. Obviously, you don't you don't have three arms. <laughs> Makes sense. Do I want bad juju? I think that would take the place of turbo tendon, so I don't think you can wear it. Yeah, it would. Okay. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, we should be able to just tear through enemies now like nothing. I mean, I'm assuming we basically just doubled our damage output because we're using two weapons. Whoops. So let's get back to where I was before. And while getting back there, let's explore a bit more around here. So I went straight to like the teleporter. Let's kill some enemies, test out my combat, and also see what's over here to the side too. All right, this should be really easy. I guess I'll still... Nah, we might as well just beat them up like normal, I guess. Yeah, let's see how much damage we can do. So there's the double attack, right? Just from one? Wait, no, that didn't seem like a double attack. I guess we're doing double damage? I mean, they are dying awfully fast. It's, it's gotta be double damage, right? Yeah, I guess so. These things give you so much money. I don't like farming, but I just want to keep farming them. Uh, this time I think I will put them to sleep. Because they did do quite a bit of damage, even though we did kill them fast. Failed, failed, sleep. The thing is horrifying. It's like an upside down person. Ew. Um, I should probably heal, but I don't have that many vegetables left. So if I want to heal, the best thing to do is probably go find a bed. Uh, Alright, let's attack you. Let's get the last one. Should have enough health for this. Try to put them to sleep. Fail, fail, sleep. Eh. Ow. Ow. Uh, hmm. I guess use the last vegetable to heal? normal attack for you, and then I think a space shuriken. Yeah, it deals double damage. I'm already doing double damage what I was before because I'm dual wielding, so this should kill in one hit. Let's see if it does. Yeah, 68. Nice. Alright, at this point, we should be freaking rich. Yeah, 2700 uh, bucks now. 
made back almost all of the money that I just spent. Let's go ahead and save it. Now, if I go here, there is a bed. There is a bed somewhere in here. Yeah, let's go. Because I can always go back, I think. So let's go sleep. And the nice thing is, the more I do combat, the more meat I get, which means, at least once I die, I guess, I can go back and increase my maximum health. Which then means I don't die as often. Alright, so let's explore the rest of this place. I'm assuming these enemies are harder, maybe. Oh my god. <laughs> they're so creepy. I, I think they're dolls. Yeah, they're dolls, but some are upside down and they've got weird things on their faces and ew, I don't like it. I don't like it. Go to sleep. Go away. And space shuriken. The space shuriken the upside down one. That's the creepiest. Yeah, foothead. That's slughead and that's foothead. Fail, sleep, failed. Eh. Let's kill that thing. There we go. Good. Damn, they do a lot of damage. Paralysis poison. Ugh. Okay, so Wayne's out of the game, so let's space shuriken. Should be able to kill you in one hit. Come on. Oh man, 68 damage and still didn't die. There we go. Muscle applique. Muscle applique. What would that be? Permanently increases mightiness by two. Oh. Excellent. Well, let's use one on Wayne. Oh, I just used both. Whoops. Alright, Wayne is very, very strong. Also, Wayne is suffering from a bad effect right now, which I can cure using the vegetables that I ate, right? Yeah. We need to go get healed again. Hmm. Yeah, even though we're a lot more powerful, this is getting tedious to go back and forth to heal. Hmm. Alright, I don't think I'm going to try to fight every enemy over there. I'm going to go back and I'm just going to try to explore around and see if I can find any items and stuff like that. Rather than fight the enemies. I love how once you enter a zone, I love how everybody re-dies. Oh, there we go. Excellent. Come, come back here. What ability will we learn this time? Mystic Meat. Hmm. Sounds delicious. Remove status ailments from all allies. Prevent status ailments for three turns. Okay, and it's really cheap, too. Come on, stop. Stop guarding that place. Run! Alright, we made it. Let's go fight the Cthulhu head. Uh, I better save it first, because that thing seems nasty. Actually, let's get the garbage can first. Parasite crystal. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's an instrument. Greatly increases maximum will points. Decreases flesh points. Hmm, so it's a glass cannon kind of thing. 
Okay, how much damage does it do? Does it say? Unless I'm blind, it doesn't seem to say. I think it's worth it. I feel like it's not worth it. Hmm. Alright, fight me. Oh! When the sign said touching it causes death, it was it literally meant that. It didn't mean that it's so dangerous that you'll probably die. It means literally you you just die. <laughs> okay. Good to know. Yeah, I don't know if you remember, but there was a sign there. Well, I, I guess it was last episode that I read it. It said if you touch the skull or whatever, you die. Very true. Maximum flesh rose 24 points. Cool. So what are we up to now? 128 and 148. Okay, cool. So thankfully we can just warp right back there, right? Um... I activated the crystal. Which one was it, though? Hmm. So I actually proceed to go down the stairs. As it said. You qualify if you have three deaths, and I've just achieved three deaths. Oh, I'm not sure if you should really call that an achievement, but uh, there it is. Yeah, which one was it? What was the color? Blue was the original one, right? I've gone to this one. It's either green or red. Red? I don't know. I feel like it's really not gonna. D d okay, you know, what, let's let's see what's down here. Nice job, thank you. Nice job, thank you. Uh. Ooh, a water cooler. You doing all right, buddy? You look kind of sick and blobby. Squish, squish. Time steals away like a stream, and we glide hence away. Squish, squish. Squish, squish. Alright, so this is the executive lounge, huh? Bestial axe was found. <laughs> okay, so this is like, is this a place you get to go to because you keep dying and so the game is like, you know what, you keep dying so here's a bunch of stuff to make it so you don't die. Alright, so we can use a paper cup again. Will permanently increase by 25 points, excellent. Alright, so let's check out the bestial axe. Oh my god, look at my mightiness. Look at that mightiness from 33 to 56. Whew. Okay, so mightiness is actually your damage. Like, I guess it's directly your damage. I didn't realize that. I thought it meant, like, defense, you know? But apparently it's not. Um, so that means I can go check out Dedus and see what the Parasite Crystal does to damage. Alright, so yeah, greatly decreases damage. But it greatly increases maximum will points. So yeah, I guess if you want to be a glass cannon and you happen to have really good spells, that's a good thing to go for. But I don't think that's the case. I don't have amazing spells. Let's go rest again. Get our willpower back. Now that our willpower limit has been increased. Okay. Do I want to bet on red? Were there any other crystals? There's no crystals down here, right? Nope. Let's hope red takes me back to where I want to go. Oh, it's reset. I should probably write down where these go, right? Yeah, so blue... Home... Yellow... I don't remember the name of the place. Garbl-blah-blah-blah... Blah, some... <laughs> some town? And red goes to... We are about to find out. Oh, back here. Well... Darn. Alright, so red goes to tent. Now I know. 
Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, before the beginning of the next episode, I'm gonna go ahead and make my way back to where I was before. And... Resume exploring the area, but this time, not gonna touch the skull that instantly kills you. Because instantly dying hurts. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.